and we're back at Ramsgate. Guess what? Hi, how are you? <laughs> the, I think he's not the guy that we saw here jumping on the cut before. <laughs> anyway, can I just tell how amazing this arm looks? Just look at it. Gives me this uh, soldier ninja. I don't know. It's like a mix of soldier and a ninja combined together, especially with the helmet on. Ah! The vibe of an futuristic soldier ninja shit. You know, type of dudes you see in the anime. It's quite cool. Wills await your words. This game gives me the Zelda vibe, you know, through its graphics. I don't know why. Probably be probably because it is inspired by Zelda and Monster Hunter. Let's look at these weapons. It looks so cool. Thank yeah, you for your I don't know what's so craft yet. Wonder what this is. Oh yeah, it's the hunter. I don't know what they call that. Hunter bulletin board. I don't know. I wish we could buy houses, you know, where you can go inside and I don't know, maybe eat some stuff to give you boost. Is that a Monster Hunter reference? <laughs> yeah, I miss the felines, bro. What the fuck is this? What is that? Oh shit, what is that? Oh, okay, it's like the thing on the houses where it catches the water from the rain and it redirects it to the sewer system. Bruh. But that actually isn't the sewer system, isn't it? Oh, you can see under it. It should be directed through this metal thing. I think it is like the sewer. So for this world, I don't know. Who gives a shit? I'm not the developer. I didn't. I didn't contribute any ideas yet. Oh, actually, I did. I asked them to add like uh, salt stuff. You know, since they're like uh, tall grasses in in the hunt. You know, the place where the islands are floating. There's like tall grasses there. I wish you could like crouch and you know. Uh, plan out like the like so for example four of you guys will be hiding in bushes trying to get close to the behemoth and then you'll while hiding you'll use the what do you call this airstrike yeah airstrike beacon while hiding you know for like uh, ambush you just damage at least four of those could probably make huge, huge damage, bro. It would be fun if they added some like uh, stealth mechanic in the game, where the monster will chase you, things like that. And I don't like the mechanic where the monster just disappears into oblivion just to find them in another place, like they teleported. Even though they added like a jumping animation. I don't like it teleporting, I want to see it jump, you know? Like actually seeing it uh, flying through the air where you follow it. That would be pretty cool, bro. I wish they had that feature. Anyway, this world is actually rendered really, really nicely. I like the graphics. It's cartoonish. But not that cartoonish. It gives me the Zelda vibe, like I said, and uh, how to train your dragon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. definitely it resembles how to train your dragon. And yeah, I think you well, notice my character here. I've tried, you know, the stereotype Viking look. He looks like Ragnar from the Viking series. <laughs> Well, he doesn't actually look like Ragnar since Ragnar had like braids behind his head. But that's that's that is the only way I could look similar to a Viking, I guess. Well, in this game, anyway. 
Yeah, I quit idle as Ragnar actually. Anyway, enough of that, let's go hunting. 